Bulgaria has been in several Balkan wars in the past and, well, they've lost a majority of them. We're gonna get revenge on all of our neighbors, all these losers, and we're gonna make Bulgaria strong again. We're gonna make it the Prussia of the Balkans like it was destined to be. What, what factories? What are factory? We have one military factory, one sieve. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Why are we losing that much money? I might have just sold you too strongly in the intro. I don't know if I'm going to be able to save this one. Like, I thought we'd at least be comparable to Greece or something, but no, we're, we're significantly weaker. In fact, now that I look at it, the only neighbor we're stronger than is Macedonia. Anybody can beat Macedonia if they have at least two hands and two feet, okay? Okay, so I think my first act on this country is going to be my signature one. We're going to defund the old people we're gonna have to defund everything basically so we're just gonna piss every piss off every side of the political spectrum see that that's just proof i don't back any sides guys i i hate everybody equally oh my god i can upgrade my laboratory equipment look at that we're increasing taxes and making our civilians suffer and it improves our country this is if so eastern european i am role playing like a chad right now well i just defunded like everything in the country also lost most of our political power gain this legit sucks i thought bulgaria had better stuff to do than this i thought you know i i thought bulgaria was okay like i know they're not the biggest richest in the world but they're not from yugoslavia so i thought they'd actually have a running system like an actual functioning economy and everything oh hey look at this there's a social democratic party well, what the hell are we doing as conservatives get, get, get out of here dude oh look at that political power oh failed new government to oh my god <laughs> It's just taking the piss out of me. Okay, dude. You really think I'm gonna do that? I ain't entertain your gold digging ass. Dude, that's just disrespectful. I hope I get a chance to kill you in this game. Oh, hey, there was just another election. I didn't even notice. If, well, I, I, lucky me. If I did, if we didn't win that, we would have been back to negative 500. <laughs> I, could, I could almost hear the whistles of death behind me. Someone in my Discord server said they played Millennium Dawn for a few hours and only got to 2002? Sounds like a skill issue. If you want, you can join that. Maybe you can roast people like that who have lousy computers. Maybe he has like a MacBook. People have MacBooks in that server. Like you. Oh shit, we have enough PP. Look at this. Boom! Oh, come on. It takes a whole year? Dude. I, I don't know if I can have an economy in a year. I it doesn't really look like I'm going to. So if we remove our additional expenses, we'll have a deficit of about 0.159, right? If we maximize our defunding of the old people, we'll be making a profit. We might have done enough taxing. We, is it? <laughs> yes! We're saying green is Bulgaria. Who's done that? Tell me who in the history of Bulgaria has had green income money bags? I really... Oh, okay, this is getting interesting. That might be good, actually, because if they're going to beat each other up, then maybe it'll be weekend by the time I'm ready. Dude, look at this excellent Hoi 4 AI. Double the manpower, and they can't even push. Oh, I think Romania won this one. Well, I mean, it looks like Romania did take a little bit of beating on their division, so that's good news. Let's go. People are trading with us. Holy shit. Did we get a good resource? We got special. Holy. Yes, we're going to get diamond armor to all the soldiers now. That's cracked. Uh oh. Wait a minute, Yugoslavia, into the Romanian heartland they go. Boom, fascism has risen up from the dead. And there's the unholy alliance once again. Uh, thank God I'm not gonna be fighting that anytime. Excuse me, when did that happen? Look, Switzerland, as long as you stay up there, don't go any closer to me and we'll be chill, okay? I ain't looking to be inherited by banks anytime soon. What if we justify in Romania first? 255 days, then we go here, 100, boom. I don't know why Yugoslavia is so short, but we'll go with that. Also, another thing to take note of, they have like zero planes. I got the whole fucking fleet on my side. I am, I'm jacked. My air force cannot be stopped, bro. Okay, that's done. How long does that last till February 12th? I'll wait till the very last day to declare that war so the Yugoslavians have more time to survive. Okay, I barely caught myself on February 11th. Let's, let's see what happens. Should we just kill this guy? Why isn't Romania trying to take this land back? Where the fuck are they? <laughs> Dude, you, you got in circle. Great. Good job, Romania. You're now in half. You know, you should probably not 
give up land like that to them. I'm sure as long as we hold Sophia down, uh, it will be fine. Okay, honestly, I feel like Yugoslavia is about to just kill itself. I'm not even gonna lie with you. I mean, I could, I could circle Yugoslavia right now if I really wanted to. Okay. Jesus Christ, did Romania get everything? Like, bro, this is exactly why... <laughs> No matter what, I, I got pissed off enough where I just said, fuck it, full invasion. I need to see what's happening by here. Look! Look! It's wide open! All I needed was one single fucking state. And I couldn't even get that. Is the game gonna call that an excellent strategy by the AI? Be so stupid that you die and prevent the player from getting any benefit out of it? It's what you call literal cheese. Maybe we'll just go after Macedonia. <laughs> <laughs> well, why are we justifying this menacing nation that I will never be able to defeat? We're gonna do some spy work in Romania. We're gonna see if we can slowly convert them to a different ideology. If we can do that, at the very least, then maybe Ukraine will take away their guarantee and, you know, actually make this video entertaining. Because this has kind of sucked lately, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, you guys probably want to see an actual winnable war after nine years. I would have nine years for any action and seven action is just kicking a toddler in the face. Can they even win a 1v1? No, they cannot. I will say, compared to the time I was Albania and had to fight North Macedonia, that was a lot easier. Probably because I'm not fucking Albania, though. There we go. Bulgaria learned how to finally get a boner. Look at that, though. That actually increased her income a lot. Holy. When did Macedonia become land of the rich? If you want another fun fact, uh, my internet is currently down. It is still down now that I minimized my tab. I don't know what the fuck's going on today. Some, it's, it, Today's a weird day. I wanted to do literally school work today because I have a project due next week, but I can't even do that because it's gone. The only, in fact, the only thing I can do is literally play this game. <laughs> Fuck's sake, why? Bitch, I need her to do the fascism. Frankly, Romania deserves to die for this. I, I, I'm gonna blame everything bad that happens now on Romania. I, I hate you, Romania. I despise you. Your country came to fill the yellow bar, and yet you have the audacity to troll me like this. <laughs> Damn, that's some balls, Putin. Dude just went to war against the Angle Alliance. I, I would say hope you win, but um, you have Poland occupied. Fuck you for that. 94% chance of a successful coup. Did it? Thank God. I was worried it was about to give me a goose egg there. Okay, good. Ukraine has removed the guarantee. That's exactly the whole point of this. There we go. Hey, that's already done. Um, I'm not sure why Romania is kind of just sitting back and doing nothing. Did Yugoslavia break free from them? Okay. Maybe they built up enough points to break free with that autonomy focus. When they do that with me, they just sit fully able to break free and then they never do. I guess the AI hates being a puppet of an AI, but it's fine when I puppet it. There we go. Now Bulgaria is looking a little sexier. It's a it's a start in 2011. It's it is it's, it's a start. Finally, I've been waiting seven long years for this war. I can finally take over ghetto France. 35 bombing damage. That's gonna be a GG. I'm thinking. Yeah, that's right. Even if I have box syndrome, you you can't stop me. Okay, yeah. The problem with the Bulgarian army right now is we're so stretched out. This is kind of painful. I was worried this would happen, but I think we'll be fine because they're even more spread out than we are. Throw their bodies in the ocean. That's what they deserve for trying to naval invade scumbags. Bye-bye. No one's gonna miss you. Anyway, um, Kluj Napoka. Come on. Thank you. Capitulation? Yes! Because I, mean, I only really talk this one state. I, I was gonna probably take Bucharest, but 9 million people. That doesn't seem like a lot in face value. But look at the core population of Bulgaria. It's 8 million. I would have outdone my core population with one state. That's kind of pathetic. But uh, that leaves us with two more countries on the hit list. We have Greece, the greasy boy, and we got a uh, Turkey. Turkey's actually gotten beat up quite a bit because they've been at war for so long now. Yeah, Syria has a bigger air force than them. Turkey actually got kind of steamrolled there. And Germany's dead too. Oh my. Dude, Russia's actually balling this game. Imagine the things the AI can do when I actually play past 2009. You know what? Since Big Daddy Putin has been doing so well this game, I think we're going to steal some technology from the dude. Specifically, I need a recon tank design because I need to build those. Dude, that ain't, that ain't a tank. That's like some drone with a machine gun on. On it. I mean, I'll take it. Oh no, big Boris is here. Big boy Boris is gonna really show it to Putin. <laughs> 
Alrighty, I think we're gonna try to justify against Greece. Now, I'm worried because of their democratic support. I really hope they don't get guaranteed. I mean, surely Britain, the USA, all those countries have better things to worry about right now. I wouldn't put it past the Hoi 4 AI to do something obnoxious just to fuck the player over. Hey, here we go. Okay, time to declare the war. We're just gonna go in. Balls to the wall, let's go. Yo, code red. You know what, if you wanna be a bitch and try to naval evade me, that's gonna cost you an encirclement. If they're gonna be assholes to me, then I'm gonna be assholes back. I don't care, dude. Way too far, and did the game just this game infuriates me. There, the Agus Andropolis has fallen. I, I didn't encircle people though, because they can just run around the <laughs> turkey. That should be an easy W. I don't know why that province has no defense on it, considering that's one of the most important ones for them to defend right now. Now, take the port city, and we can have a good day encircling all these kids. This is solid proof that Bulgaria is forever better than Greece. You know, I thought this would be a little more challenging, I'm not gonna lie. Oh fuck, I think they got too many people there. Oh, we broke through. We, get, we can encircle them right here. I know it. There. Boom. Holy shit. That's game over. We just won with that right there. Guaranteed. That's a W. And we double encircled them. Holy fuck. We're going in, dude. Oh, you can walk over to here from... Since when? I'll take that. Go, go, go. I didn't know you could cross to this island from up here. I thought that was an EU4 thing. I really hope I don't have to invade Crete. Thank God. Dude, this is actually getting a really sexy Bulgaria. There's literally... We only have one conquest left, and that is Istanbul. After I take that, I consider Bulgaria fucking amazing. Russia into... What? How did you even do that? Oh my God. What? This game is a W for Slavic people. As someone with Slavic heritage, wah. Alrighty, I think it's time we put the wax on the envelope. We gotta seal the deal. Brains. <laughs> I mean, they had like 300,000 men before. Not anymore. <laughs> this is one of my favorite outcomes. The AI finally gave us a good result in one game. Oh God, Italy declared war in Bosnia. Why well, have a feeling Italy's gonna come for me here very soon. Oh, well, we better end this quick because uh, if I if Italy declares war me before I declare war in Turkey. The mission won't be completed. That would be an L. God damn, this, this is gonna be a very tense 150 days. Oh no, I'm probably just gonna sit here and stare at my wall. Okay, it's time to feast on my beloved Turkey. Yeah, I don't know. They also took one of the divisions off my front line. I guess they're taking me as a joke. I guess this is offensive, so. Just gonna press a space bar and prove them wrong. Take, take a stumble before they heavily defend that bitch. Are you telling me that Oh, bro, I cannot even... I'm thinking maybe we should hold these two points and then maybe set up an invasion on a port some here in the north by uh, Zon... Son Guldak. However the fuck you pronounce Turkish words. I don't know how. Did they fix the division? The naval invasions? I can invade with 15 again. <laughs> My Don mods are uh, Giga Chads. Thank God. I hope we can take at least one port. Because I would like a little more war score than just Istanbul, you know. Also like to be out of this game before 2036. Okay, there we go. Thank God. They actually didn't even defend them. Spread like the Koof pandemic. There we go. Boom. The fact that this Kamino division is also like standing at chance. All right, this is what you get for helping Greece escape encirclements. Now you're the one getting encircled. 9%. Good lord. I better be enough to at least take East Thrace. I swear to God, if it isn't, I will not be happy. I will literally rampage the Middle East if Syria takes that from me. I mean, baby Syria couldn't even push past Malatya. So I don't think they deserve as much as I do. Look what I've done. Trabzon's gonna be their last hurrah. See ya. Bruh. Don't tell me they just fucking got away with cucking me over. Why does everybody want it? Hey, what do you know? It's the same fucking dude. Yeah, get over here. The fact that you got to keep this state is an atrocity. 